know it's been a few weeks, but here's the answer to the ponderable from Parshas Vayikra concerning the stolen haircut. Ruvain is not obligated, according to Halacha, to pay for the boy's haircut, since, after all, he never told the barber to cut the boy's hair, simply placed the boy in the barber chair. The barber decided on his own that he should be giving the boy a haircut. The barber, trying to find the father of the boy and get money from him, was told by the father of the boy that he never would have taken his son to the barber shop, that he would have cut his son's hair himself. Accordingly, the barber is out of the money and Ruvain has no obligation to pay. Shabbat Shalom.